Hi. Are you still don't see it? Hey, Tommy. How are you? Tommy Davidson. How are you? I'm good. And you? How are you? I'm just looking over your shoulder at this blonde. I'm sorry. Well, no, no, that's perfectly fine. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, and you're bluish. Yeah, uh, well, it was blue night, so. And this is a good night. PCF is doing a good thing. That's a gorgeous coat, too. That's Thank a, you. unique. Thank you. This is my stuff. This is uh, my ties. Oh, it's really? uh, uh, Yeah, tongue and cheek is my, my brand. Oh. And um, shop tongueandcheek.com. It's easy. Yeah, let's get a yeah, look yeah, at yeah, it. Uh, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Tongue yeah. and tongue tongue cheek. Yeah, tongue, tongue and cheek. cheek. Yeah, there you go. So how'd you come up with that name like that? Uh, comedy. <laughs> you know, you say something coy, it's tongue and cheek. Uh -huh. Off the cuff, I got tired of paying so much for ties, so much for different accessories that I made my own, and I want to end the fashion world. So this is what I'm doing, uh -huh. is to try to make my contribution and build myself into a designer eventually. But I'm an entertainer, you know, and... Um, so I'm making that transition, but being an entertainer, and you're from New York, am I right? I am. So you remember a guy named Sammy Davis Jr.? Yeah, I sure do. Yes. Very, very well. Yeah, very well, and one of the greatest entertainments in the world, right? Yes, he is. Yes, that's right. New York, New York! That's how he would put it. He would put it like that. that is a beautiful, <laughs> he's, a, he's a beautiful dude, and you did him beautifully. And, thank you, uh, thank you. He even came to my temple. And he's he and, and he, hold on, he's Yiddish, by the way. No, and I, so I and so, don't pay attention to the I, pay attention to the Chai. <laughs> All right, he came He came to my temple, the Actors Temple. Really? In the 47th Street. Really, okay. Yeah, he's on the wall. He's uh, okay. a respected uh, uh, a member uh, mm -hmm. from mm -hmm. the days of old. Love him to death. Uh, one of my uh, life's aspirations is to play him in a movie. Whatever that movie may be, I want to be in it. And um, I got a good start because I am a movie actor and a comedian, so and a singer. So, what do you think he had? There? What did the Rat Pack have, and what did he have in the Rat Pack that you felt uh, was inspirational for you? Uh, versatility in his perception of the world. I don't think Sammy saw himself as just a black man. I think Sammy saw himself as an American man. And an American man consists of Irish, German, Italian, Jewish. I mean, we're talking about a country that brought everyone together for pretty much one cause, to feed their kids and make sure they had a roof on their head, uh -huh. Uh -huh. you know? And it was done in a lot of different ways. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It can be ex expressed in matzo balls or collard greens, <laughs> you know, uh -huh. Uh -huh. or meatballs. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? I hear you. Uh -huh. Or hamburgers. I totally understand. You know, so I think that's what he was about. He was about what this city is about. And you know, when you give a tribute, I will say here, uh, to someone else, you are that tribute because you can recognize those things. And I, I, I throw that tribute all back to you because you see what he had in him. And I agree with everything you said. Thusly, you, you must have that inside of your soul. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I've been very, very fortunate to be able to see the world in total. You know, I've, I've just been fortunate to do that so I can see him for what he is. You know, I can see the Irish for who they are. I can see African men for who they are. I can see Latinos for who they are. I can see Jews for who they are. I mean, you can see people for who they are, not people's perception. You know, if we went off of people's perception, there'd be a little guy with a mustache, and we'd all be speaking German and reading Japanese. I hear you. I hear you. Two last quick questions. <laughs> you hear it, right? <laughs> what's, good for, what's good news for you, brother? Um, I'm doing a show called Vacation Creation. I am hosting it, uh, taking well-deserving families around the world on luxury cruises. Oh, wow. And luxury ships, the biggest ones in the world. Wow. From the Ocean Corporation and all of the brands, from Princess, you know, to Carnival. Carnival, what's up? And I'm um, representing that. Great. Last question. What does peace mean to you? We're very well with the International what is, Day of Peace. What does peace mean to me? Yes, yeah, sir. That means that we actually have a chance to save this planet. There was World War II, and uh, that was a whole world at war. Do you think we'll survive a third one? Peace means, peace means life now. Well stated. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Nice to see you.